Have you ever tried Varaniclin? Have you ever considered it as a treatment option? Varaniclin is also known as Chantix and in some countries it is referred to as Champix. In this video, we'll talk about how this medication may help, how to use it, the side effects, and when you need to be cautious with this medication. Hello everyone, this is Dr. A, Addiction Specialist. I've had many of my patients tell me good things and bad things about Chantix, so let's talk about this medication a little bit. We know that stopping tobacco use can be difficult, but understanding your treatment options improve your chances to quit. Medication is an option for treatment and Chantix is one medication you can use. I would like to state though that medications are not a silver bullet to help you stop smoking, but they can increase the odds of you being successful. A combination of medications with behavioral therapy is always best to ensure success. Varaniclin, also known as Chantix or Champix, is available in tablets by prescription only. This medication acts on the same region of the brain that nicotine attaches to, the acetylcholine receptors. It works by decreasing cravings and withdrawals, and it does this by blocking the receptors so that nicotine does not attach to them. This decreases the reinforcement you get from smoking. Studies show that varaniclin tends to work slightly better than bupropion and nicotine replacement therapies. So how do you take this medication? Well, you want to start taking varaniclin at least one week before you plan to stop smoking. The reason for this is that it will take some time for this medication to build up in your blood. Varaniclin tablets come in two strengths, 0.5 mg and 1 mg. Usually we start treatment from 0.5 mg once a day and slowly increase the dose to 1 mg twice a day. The reason we slowly increase the dose is to help with side effects. Nausea is a common side effect and this slow increase in dose helps with this. We also advise you to take this medication with food and a glass of water to help with nausea. A typical dose schedule for this medication will be day 1 to day 3. We give 0.5 mg tablet once a day. Day 4 to day 7, we give 0.5 mg tablet twice a day. This is usually 1 in the morning and 1 in the evening. Then from day 8 to the end of treatment, we give 1 mg tablet twice a day. Now it may well be that you forget to take a dose. If you miss a dose, take it as soon as you remember. If it is almost time for your next dose, you want to skip the missed dose and take the next one as directed. Please do not take double the dose of this medication. Treatment with varaniclin is typically for 3 months but can be for up to 6 months. Common side effects of varaniclin include nausea, abnormal dreams, difficulty sleeping, headaches, vomiting, gas, change in taste perception, anxiety and depression. Before taking Chantix, talk to your healthcare provider if you have kidney disease or if you are receiving dialysis. If this is the case, your healthcare provider may need to prescribe a lower dose for you. The reason is that varaniclin is cleared from your body by your kidneys. You also want to let your healthcare provider know if you are pregnant, planning to become pregnant or if you are breastfeeding. Other times you want to be cautious with varaniclin if you have a mental disorder, history of seizures, heart disease or if you drink alcohol. To further help with quitting smoking, varaniclin can also be combined with bupropion or nicotine replacement therapies. Please note that this information is not intended to be a substitute for professional medical advice, diagnosis or treatment. This does not constitute a physician-patient relationship. Please seek the advice of your physician or other qualified health providers regarding your health. For more tips on quitting cigarettes and leaving smoke-free, subscribe to this channel. I'll talk with you soon.